How Abayomi Shegun Oluwa Shishon stole billions of naira from his company and blamed it on Arabian hackers. Abayomi was employed as a web developer in Afric Arbitrage System. Due to his position, he was given all the access to the platform's sensitive data. Abayomi worked in this crypto firm for one year, studying the system and waiting for the right time to strike. The opportunity presented itself when the CEO of the firm was set to undergo a liver transplant and trusted Abayomi to oversee the company's operations. Little did the CEO know he had just handed his company over to a serial fraudster. Abayomi colluded with his criminal friends to steal over 87 billion naira from the company's blockchain account. Thinking his boss wouldn't survive the operation, Abayomi transformed himself into an overnight billionaire. His first criminal act was obtaining a Ghanaian passport which he used in acquiring other international citizenships and properties in Tanzania, Dubai and the UK. His flamboyant lifestyle included a car dealership. He purchased a 450 million naira plaza in Lagos, 1 billion naira worth of land around Dangote refineries and spent another 1 billion naira on interior decoration of a 3-star hotel in mainland Lagos state. He travelled across the globe on first-class tickets all funded by the stolen funds. Abayomi eventually ran out of luck when his boss fortunately survived his health challenges. He uncovered the betrayal and quickly involved the Interpol, initiating a manhunt to bring Abayomi to justice. The long arm of the law eventually caught up with Abayomi, who willingly confessed to his crimes. His charges ranged from financial crimes and data theft to cyber security crimes and fraudulent takeover of the online financial platform. He was charged to court to answer for his crimes. So far, I haven't gotten any new information about the fate of Abayo Mishegu Oluwa Shishon. Please, leave a comment if you know about the current whereabouts of this elusive froster.